Don't be late again. Where have you been? You're gonna have to wait in here. Why? It'll be along soon. Then you can go. I told you not to be late. You stupid girl. blessing for we believe she is already free we thank you for your blessing because we believe she is already free alex yeah he was a great guy always upbeat if you happen to see his wife can you tell her we're all thinking about her have you met his wife Scylla? only a few times did they seem happy together the first time i met her they did but on the most recent occasion, she seemed, I don't know, angry, perhaps? I've written you a prescription for temazepam. It's a month-long course. Try to use them less and less during the course of the month. I'm fine for now. Thank you very much for asking. Did you have a good journey down today? Oh, it was very long. Two and a half hours on the train. All to be greeted by a messy flat. I'm sorry. No, it's not your fault. It's that messy son of mine. He's never taken any responsibility. Never settled down and find himself a nice girl. He still thinks he's a child. Have you come down for a fish sleep today? Yes, we all live there. And I thought Peter would be joining us after university, but he appears to still be in a honeymoon phase of living in the big city. What is it you said you did for a living? I'm a graphic designer. Any projects you worked on? Yes, actually. <laughs> Five years back, I work at a battery power station. Did I say something wrong? Mom, don't! Why didn't you tell me? Tell you what? Why didn't you tell me you're gay? You're gay, aren't you? Now you find your voice. Why didn't you say anything earlier? Lloyd, what did you tell her? I did not say nothing, I promise. Don't take this out on Lloyd. He's your boyfriend, isn't he? Why didn't you tell me for five years? I thought you'd be disappointed. Mum? What? Tell Peter you're not disappointed in him. It's fine, Mary. I already know. Peter, I'm not disappointed. But you'd rather have had a girlfriend. I suppose you knew about this. Huh. I see. So you've been having a big laugh behind my back. 